Hey everybody, I'm Scott. I'm Diona, CPST and safety advocate. And today I'm gonna to talk about bracing. So bracing is when a rear facing car seat touches the vehicle seat in front of it. Now Diono does allow bracing, but only if the vehicle manufacturer allows it. So what you wanna do is you wanna look in your vehicle manual in the airbag section and see if it mentions anything about not allowing anything to touch the back of the vehicle seat or putting pressure on the vehicle seat from underneath or hanging anything heavy in the seat pocket. If it prohibits any of that, then bracing would not be allowed because it's gonna throw off the airbag sensors in the seat. So what you wanna do then is just move that vehicle seat forward just a little bit, about to where you can get a pencil between the car seat and the vehicle seat. I say pencil because if you put a larger rear facing child in the, in the car seat, it's gonna move down just a little bit because of the weight of the kid. So the width of a pencil is about where you want that gap to be. If it doesn't say anything about airbag sensors in your vehicle seats, then bracing is okay.